Hey Libra, this reading is the third reading. I didn't put it on the first video because I went too long on, I think it was the ladies reading, one of the readings I went way too long on. So I decided to do a third, I mean a second video for the LGBTQ community. So you get your very own separate um, video. All right, so this reading is for the LGBTQ community, anyone with Libra placements, spirit and angels anyone for the highest good for the week of the 13th of september to the 22nd of september 2020 what do we need to know for this reading what's most important commitment and joyous fun somebody else had joyous fun i can't remember who but uh nice all right so some kind of commitment and joyous fun so wow wouldn't we like all like to have a joyous fun commitment all right, let's get into it. What else do we need to know, please? What else do we need to know for this reading for anyone with Libra placements? We have mature man. We have wealthy man. We have also the um, mountain showed up here. So this might have been something difficult. There might be a little, there might be a mountain to climb to get to each other, but it could be really nice. All right, there's gonna be change, that's good. When we see a mountain, we know there's gonna be a decision, there's information coming in. The house was at the bottom, okay? So we might decide to move in together. All right, so there's there's some kind of a commitment here. It's between two men. We have mature man and wealthy man. Um, and we also have the mountain right smack dab in the middle here. Um, showing that there's been a hard, something heavy, a mountain to climb but there's going to be change these two cards are together right in the middle of the reading so i feel like there's going to be something that changes in a way um to make this a little easier there's uh adjudication for me this usually means some decision being made it doesn't have to be a court decision that's going to bring in good news the rider for me is always good news i mean it's a carousel horse there's a rainbow underneath of her she looks like she's wearing the uh, red protection cloak here actually it's not even a cloak it's it's adorable whatever it is but she looks so happy and joyous on her carousel horse with her rainbow carrying her letter bag and her letter so some decisions being made here there's going to be good news i feel at the bottom we had the house so this doesn't have to be a her i keep saying her because she all these could be different genders especially since we're doing the lgbtq reading if these are two women they're two women so if this resonates with you whether you're male or female please just you know make it work you'll know if it's your story i feel all right so we have commitment and joy is fun we have these two men it hasn't been easy but there's change coming and good news i mean it's that simple let's find out what the mountain was here what's the mountain a gift all right so what else do we need to know about the mountain i feel as though if something was heavy or hard or whatever yep twill and labor whatever was heavy was actually is going to turn out to be a blessing tell me about the change what about the change okay confusion in the partnership all right so there could have been some kind of um confusion around this with the maze and the courtship there could have been there's change coming. So look, if you've gone from heavy energy to com and confusing energy, you're going to feel, you're going to realize there's a gift involved here. This was like a blessing of some sort and um, there's change coming. There's definite change coming. All right, let's look at the adjudication. Why is adjudication here, please? Too many, just one or two. Why adjudication, please? Why is judication here? Okay, bad health. All right, so again, there could have been something heavy. Bad health doesn't mean have to mean literally someone's health, but it could be. It could mean the health of the relationship. Wait, guys, I got something flipped here. All right, could mean um, the situation. It could be the relationship. Something here went through a heavy time. Tell me about the um, adjudication. One more, please. 
And this could have been a tough decision, bad health adjudication, right? Yeah, it had to do with a heavy decision that needed to be made in the partnership. We've got the anchor and we have the owls, which indicate another card of partnership. So somebody had to make a really tough decision here. All right, let's get the rider. What's the rider doing here? What is this coming in? There's some kind of information. Why is the rider involved? Sudden wealth and occupation. So um, with sudden wealth and occupation, this means somebody might have to accept a really cool job. It doesn't mean sudden wealth. It could be, but um, there could be a sudden opportunity with occupation here where someone would have to travel. Um, I feel like I'm, I'm getting travel. I don't know if that's true, but I have the change card. I have the rider here. I feel like someone is going to make some kind of decision in a work environment or having to do, and it might m involve moving. Um, let's look at the two men. We've got wealthy man and mature man. Tell me more. Pathway, yep, absolutely. We've got family room and pathway. So this is the journey these people are supposed to be on together. Look, bottom of the deck journey. I can't make this up. I just said that. This is their journey as partners with marriage at the bottom as well. Somebody is meant to come together here to be together, I feel, as family in a committed partnership. All right, this is really nice. This is someone's pathway. This is the, the path they're supposed to be on. And as soon as I said journey, journey was sitting at the bottom of the deck. That's amazing. All right, this is somebody's pathway. This is somebody's journey. They're supposed to be on this. Um, someone may make a huge decision that was not easy. And it has to do with their partnership. I feel like it also has to do with their job, moving, changing jobs, something there is, um, you know, of course, money involved when you're going to be working um, with jobs. One of these people might have a very influential job, whatever it is. I feel like the journey these people are on is the right path they're supposed to be on. It has to do with commitment. It has to do with family or considering each other family in whatever way. And the house is the overall energy here. This all has to do with someone deciding to really enter into a commitment in a way you're going to really like it this is going to bring a lot of joy to your life i feel like we have two people that are going to either move in together buy a house together move together relocate i don't know you guys have to tell me something's going on here all right very simple and clear reading let's get into some after tarot what do we need to know about what comes next here and this could actually be two women instead of two men so what however it works guys however it works what do we need to know here, please? What comes next? Queen of Wands, which could be a king. Um, conflict. This could be inner conflict, mental conflict. What else? And it also is overcoming something. Tell me more. Clarity coming in. Family coming in. Beautiful. Anything else? Just one or two, please. What else do we need to know about what comes next? What comes next? There's some kind of clarity coming in here. I do feel like someone um, had some conflict over whatever this is. They really did. And I do feel like there's going to be... Oh, Ten of Pentacles at the bottom. That's nice. All right. So you're, you're having a completion. You're going to have a brand new cycle in your life. You're having um, stability and happiness. These are the two best tens you can get. The Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Cups. There's some kind of completion coming in. I feel like you've overcome something. Um, for some of you, it was a heavy decision that needed to be made. All right. Somebody is going to take what's, you know, owed to them and move on. I feel like you're going to, I do feel like someone's moving towards a new work opportunity. And we have the two people here. Um, this is going to be, somebody's getting a lot of clarity on this. They're getting some kind of truth and honesty. We have um, Queen of Swords, very honest, straightforward person. This could be a king or queen. 
of Swords. This could be Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. We also have the Queen of Wands, who could be a king or a queen. This is um, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. They don't have to be these signs, but they could have it somewhere in their chart. But they're two people, look at them facing each other. I feel making some kind of a decision to maybe even pack up and go in another direction. I feel for a lot of you, you're moving on to something. It's going to end a chapter in your life, but it's the beginning of something beautiful and new at the same time. So, and look, movement, quick movement. So this could be, look, to homes, moving homes. Look at that. Some of you are packing up and moving homes, no doubt about it. I feel like this wasn't an easy decision to make, um, especially for one of the partners, um, maybe for both. Um, it wasn't an easy decision, but it's all in the name of, I just feel like it's time for a change or it's time to really commit to something. It's going to bring joy in your life. I love it. Um, big completion coming, guys. Be ready for a gorgeous new beginning. You are on the right path. This is your journey you're supposed to be on. Love it. Guys, fill me in, please. Let me know if this resonated, if you know what this means. A lot of times these readings are very cryptic to me. I mean, I can only go by what I'm being sent, but I don't know who they're for or what the, you know, what each of you, each of you are obviously going to have a slightly different story, sometimes a, a very different story. So I love hearing from you guys. If you want to comment down below and let me know if you know what this is. For some of you, this is a job change. Um, but let me know guys okay all right thanks so much for um tuning in uh let me know if you enjoyed having your own special um lgbtq readings so that you guys could place genders where you want instead of me pinning genders on them um anyway guys i hope you enjoyed them um and i'll try to do them as often as i can for you if you need a personal reading my information is directly beneath this video in the description box and that's for full readings these were short oracle readings but the prices there are for full tarot and oracle readings okay all right just um let me know by reaching out by the the email address is there as well reach out by email if you're looking for reading but if you want to comment about this reading and let me know if we connected energy comment down below okay guys talk to you soon please like share subscribe much appreciated bye